Welcome to the Workplace Strategy video series. In this session, you'll learn how we connected Workplace to our IT systems for a seamless launch. In addition to executive engagement, the right group structure, a solid communication plan, and early champions, we made sure it was easy for everyone in our organization to get onto Workplace. We started our technical integration by ensuring we got all of our employee accounts set up properly. We considered managing people in Workplace directly using a CSV file or even the SKIM API, but we decided to make the upfront investment to connect Workplace with our existing identity provider, as that is our source of truth for employee information. It also made sense for us to connect Workplace to single sign-on, so our employees can access Workplace as easily as any of our other tools. Once we provisioned users, we wanted to make sure everyone received their invitations to join Workplace. To do this, we went to our email application to whitelist the IP addresses Workplace mail servers use to send emails. By whitelisting the Workplace IP addresses, not only did we ensure our email server delivers all Workplace invitation emails, but it also ensures that the emails anyone would need to reset their passwords won't get blocked or sent to spam folders. Once we finished provisioning our people and whitelisting Workplace emails, we set up integrations with a few of our most used applications in Workplace. We wanted our employees to do much more than communicate on Workplace, so we planned Workplace to be our easy-to-use interface for many applications. We searched the integrations directory for the tools our organization was using. For example, before our Workplace launch, we set up Kronos so employees can request time off through Workplace. We integrated Microsoft SharePoint, so people can share and collaborate on their documents in Workplace. And we set up ServiceNow, so employees can request help from IT right in the IT Help Desk Workplace group. We wanted to get our integrations right, so our people would go to Workplace first for getting all of their important work done. Now, it's your turn. Prepare for your Workplace launch success by planning your technical integrations. And if you are looking for more best practices, check out the Customer Resource Center. Happy launch day!